SP is following the NC State Lady Wolf Pack as they make it to the Final Four. It's been a long time coming, Chanel, but these girls seem fired up and ready to go for their big time matchup. Well, John, really, when you look at it from the men's and women's side, it's really quite a historic journey in both aspects. This NC State women's team came in doubted, unranked in the preseason rankings, and slowly have worked their way up and proved themselves as now just one of the four teams left in the big dance. Now, it's going to be no small task in tomorrow's Final Four game, taking on an unbeaten South Carolina team. But this team has proven they can compete with the best. The journey to get to this point wasn't easy having to pull out upsets over Stanford and Texas to get here. Now, during today's press conferences, it was a huge thing for Westmore to just point out the foundation that was built at NC State by Kay Yao and what she meant to this program. Not going to do it. Okay. Um, you know, um, it's just hard to describe what she means in the state of North Carolina. Uh, you know, and it was more than basketball. And even now in her passing, look at what she's doing. She was just such an unbelievable person. And uh, that, it, it, that, of course, sometimes is hard to take because I know I'm not near the person she, she was. You can hear the emotion there in Wes Moore's voice. Now, the last time that NC State actually made the Final Four was Kay Yow's team back in 1998, but they're looking to punch their first ever ticket to the national championship game. John, I'll send things back to you.